you got me started talking about hip hop daily inside a hotspot, bruh. I should buy hip hop daily. I probably can't afford it because they be they actually be banging the views in. I, I can't lie. They they do smash it. That's why it's so disheartening with all of this shit that's going on with the whole hip hop daily stealing my content type thing. Is that you know they get more views overall. They drop more videos, but like. It is garbage at the end of the day. It is garbage. Like, a lot of the info's wrong. A lot of the English is wrong. Words that aren't correct. Things that things that just don't add up. And uh, one of these channels, and I'll be honest, I think they're all run by... I, I'm pretty sure they're all run by the same guy because you, you end up hearing the same shitty uh, robot-generated voices and that same one dude. What's that one same one dude that you hear in uh, all the Hip Hop Daily videos? He's like... In the streets, it could be a matter of life and death. And in Chicago, you gotta kill or be killed. That's how KTS Dre ended up linking up with his ops and going on a ride out that ended up taking the life of two enemies. Motherfucker. Finna, finna smoke him, bro. I'm gonna catch this motherfucker, bro. Inside a hotspot on the same shit. I I'm gonna expose these fuckers right now. I'm finna expose these fuckers right now because I've had it. I've actually had it. So look, peep this, peep this, all right? I'm about to expose these clowns, and I'm pretty sure it's all the same guy. Fuck them. Peep this. Ain't no rap beef, and it ain't no real beef unless somebody got shot or something, or unless you know what somebody- People told me, people told me you and Youngboy was- Now, this is a video, how King Von lost his life beefing with NBA Youngboy and Quando Rondo over a shorty. Whatever. I'm going to break all of this down with the actual facts in my video. But let's see what this clown did. This really this really uh this really spun me, right? Check this out. Hang on. Where is it? Hello. 2 days ago, Janiel was spotted in <laughs> jumped into the the situation. We can do the battle. Young boy fun at sleeping with YB's she was in never about me. Why? I need you money. I got on right together. Started sleeping with surprise, surprise. Wait. Do me. He got a lot of take. I look at it like oh. every I like later. My king for the beat. There's a part of this video, right? This tape, the real end, the Hang final on. one being the one that led to King Von getting smoked. Bro, I'm one about of to the others was with Louisiana rapper Jay. One of the people was Louisiana rapper Jay the Youngin. Who ended up getting smoked by King Vaughn. That's a true fact. Ducking and hiding. <laughs> Follow me closely now. Vaughn called Cap and YB songs about all the. We have. I'm gonna make sure that my. No, no. It's like they love. And ended in Vaughn catching a bullet. Sadly. I'm on the wrong video, but we we're about. To, we're, I'm I'm gonna find the right bit. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where's the one? And expose him. Is maybe it is this one? Yeah, you mm. I think this is the one. Mixtapes. Then decide that the song was a diss toward Bond and Clay 530. And Sam was at the gap to contact the police as a Friday news to his fallen friend. Lord Timney popular in this later on that day. Experience. Quando's musical abilities helped him get change for the better once his career really took off. He was right. Within two days, his mixtape had a mad heat. Not to mention there were times. King Von. On November 6, 2020, an altercation broke out between King Von and Quando Rondo outside an Atlanta nightclub, leading to a shootout that resulted in the death of King Von. Quando and his entourage claimed that they were acting in self-defense and Von was the aggressor. There was footage of Von throwing punches at Quando's crew prior to the gunfight. Surveillance also showed Rondo helping Lil Tim to get to the hospital afterwards. Quando publicly remained silent on the incident until two weeks later when he released his song End the Story, which was assumed to be a reference to Von's song trilogy, Crazy Story. Basically, what I'm about to expose these, these clowns for is, uh, is, is essentially they get their scripts off wikipedia so a lot of the information that they put in their videos is just from wikipedia and there was one of their videos man i'm bugging not being able to find this there was one of their videos that i was watching on Quando recently and like i just i just so happened 
to uh to have i think it was this one like no, i just so happened to have like kwando and von's uh wikipedia's like open and i was reading it and listening and i was like hold up they just they just uh, this shit's just stolen from wikipedia bro i could not believe it bro actually i could believe it i complete i immediately believed it it was facts but um bro once you catch the thread of this shit Frank. Even as much success comes, how much money and shorty? Remember how tight Young on his side? F no fucking ramp. Rondo. And the show he did, boy and Kodak. Where is it? And this led. No, I'm bugging. I'm bugging. I've got to find the specific bit because there was a part of the video. You get the gist. There's a part of the video. And it was just straight up Wikipedia. It was just straight, straight up. Straight up Wiki. Hang on. I've got to find it. I've got to find it. Wait. Wait. Bro, I gotta find it. Fun at sleeping with YB's exes. Halted in Vaughn losing his life. Vaughn continued pushing young boys' butt together. Son, worse. Once these dudes all day and forth like Holyfield and Tyson. Maybe, maybe it was Hip Hop Daily, not inside a hot spot. Oh, no, 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 it's this one. No, no, here we go. Okay, this is what I really wanted to expose them for. Because, uh, wait. Because, look, everybody knows that I've been working on this Von video for months, right? And it's all about Von being a serial killer. Like, I've said this a million times. And these motherfuckers, they, I feel like they're watching. If they're watching now, bro, I'm going to smoke you when I catch you. But um, King Von the Demon into the mind of a serial killer. Now, look, I know there's a million videos about Von and a lot of people be making videos about Von. But this is damn near... Like, I'm not saying my video was going to have the same title, but, like, ain't that different, all right? So these motherfuckers, either it's a coincidence, or these motherfuckers are straight up stealing my stealing my ideas. But the thing is, I saw this, and I was like, oh, no. I was like, oh, no. They've stolen my idea. They've stolen my King Von serial killer idea. And then I watched it, and there was no new info in it, and it was just a bunch of bullshit, and they didn't cover any of the important stuff. Which just was was interesting to me, but anyway. Look, well now the police have started providing birthday party times and stuff. Oh, as we know, Vaughn met his end after an altercation with Quando Rondo outside a club in Atlanta, where Quando homie Lil Tim pulled out the strap and hit him up. From the looks of things, if he didn't lose his life, many things could have happened. He could have took off and really took over the game. He could have been behind bars. Do you think I could make one of these videos? Like, if I went, like, uh... Just from memory. Just straight up from memory. Like, if I took a Hip Hop Daily video... Rappers these days. It's, like, stolen my content. Shit, got the wrong thumbnail manager on that one, didn't they? Um... Wait. What's, like, a really popping one? Wait, i got to find the music, though, too. i got to find the music. Hang on. Wait, I'm going to make... We're going to make an original Hip Hop Daily video. We need the instrumental. It's that. Wait, God damn it! Wait, we need a, we need a we need a hip hop daily type beat. Hip hop daily type beat. Come on, someone's got to have done. No one's done a hip hop daily type beat. You're kidding me. Oh, you're joking. Okay. Damn. Uh, uh, what's the beat? Can anyone find me the beat? Can anyone find me the bitch? Ah, oh, shit. What's it called? Uh, bruh. Is the beat in their tags? Wait, inside a hotspot. Um, nah. That's close. That's close. Bruh, does the hip hop daily do they have it in there? Hey, let me pick something I'm really like I, re I know a lot about, and I can do the impression. 
Yeah, yeah. Why why King Von killed female shooter KI? King Von is one of the most notorious shooters. I beg they have the beat in there. They got the beat. Damn. All right, I'm just gonna I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it do it with like some random beat. Let me just find a random beat. Like uh Trap Geek type beat. You gotta have a trap geek or a ten ninety Jake type beat at least. Any I see, they get This will do. How's this, right? Look. I feel like I'm about to freestyle. King Vaughn is one of the most iconic shooters in Shirek history. Often spotted with many of his homies. Shit, bro. This is, it's harder than it looks. On the spot. I'm just going to freestyle it. Wait, wait, okay. Wait, wait. i got to catch the flow like a, like a freestyle. Yo. Wait. <laughs> Yo, this shit's harder than it looks. Wait, I'm trying to recognize everybody. Okay. King Vaughn was certified in the streets, but there was one person that he couldn't get up with. A female shooter by the name of K.I. CPD had tried their best to stop King Vaughn, but they couldn't stop him no matter what they did. King Vaughn was a known demon in the streets, often wearing Louis Vuitton belts. But the loss of one of his day one homies would lead him to turn into a demon. King Vaughn would be seen in numerous mugshots from all of the crimes that he had committed during his life. But when a SUV crashed that was unrelated to this incident, I just used that photo for no fucking reason. And when he met Lil Dirk and O.D. Perry, that's when O Black was renamed O Black. This is a picture that doesn't relate to this situation. And here's a picture of King Vaughn that has nothing to do with anything. And I'm not actually supposed to use this much B-roll for music videos because it's not actually fair use. The female shooter, K.I., would continue to try and track down Vaughn, being pictured online with numerous guns. She would also graduate for some reason. But shooting is what she was really studying. She would be seen with fellow shooter FBG Butter, who has been doing numerous interviews recently, and some other dude who I don't know. FBG were a known gang on their block. Tuka was a main member. See, this is the thing, right? I gotta get loads of shit wrong, because you know how these guys be getting everything wrong, right? Wait, let me loop this beat. I'm probably gonna get copyrighted for this beat. That's gonna be tragic if I get copyrighted for the beat. Is he going to copyright me? No monetization. This beat is not a vet. Oh, shit. I'm probably going to get copyrighted. Let me pick another one. I need to pick another one with low views. And they're easy to get. They're easy to get. And we don't pet to bust them. Oh, brah. Brah. I'm about to lose all my, all my good copyright things, you know? I need, like, really low views isn't claimed yeah yeah here we go all right back to it back to it okay i'm back to making stuff up tuka and king Vaughn were best friends their entire lives and od perry was friends with them too fbg duck was also friends they were all from 63rd including Vaughn and ki who stole this gun from boss top <laughs> they were also members of sniper gang for some reason but one day king Vaughn would catch his ops lacking at a music video shoot, surrounded by all of his homies with O Black chains they bought themselves for not taking part in crimes. K.I. would also be a close friend of King Von's, receiving an O Black chain herself. Bruh. Just finna be freestyling here. I should freestyle as hip-hop daily. K.I. would be seen underneath a bridge wearing an R.I.P. Tuka shirt because she was the one who killed Tuka. She would also be seen posing with lots of guns and people throwing up gang signs, showing how much they liked King Vaughn. Who's the other dude? I need some other hip-hop daily voices that I can do. Oh, 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 oh dear. Young Thug and the YSL Rico <laughs> Let me do a Young Thug one. Let me do a Young Thug one. Hold up. Biggest thing I'll in do that YSL type beat. I mean, they're free for profit. Hell yeah. Because you know you know how I do. You know how I do anything for profit. Slime language too. Hell yeah. This is too good for Hip Hop Daily. They would never pick a beat this good. This is kind of wavy for them too. Up right now. YSL. 
are the most famous and successful gang in hip hop history. They made literally billions of dollars selling lean on Cleveland Avenue. I know this because I am Hip Hop Daily. I know everything about hip hop. I don't even need to research. Gunna was most famous for sitting on an enormous bag, and all of these people are completely and utterly innocent. You get the gist, man. Fuck Hip Hop Daily. You get the fucking gist. All right? Trash. Trash channel. Does nothing but copy my vids. Does nothing but. Does nothing but. God damn. You know what I'm. You know the deal. Copying, copying scripts from Wikipedia. I couldn't find the specific one. There was one I was, I, I was literally watching one whilst I was on Wikipedia looking at something, and I just was dumbfounded. I was just like, "This is the, this is just, this is just Wikipedia. Like, this is just, this is just exactly what's on Wikipedia. Like, what? It's just crazy. 